Hello everyone and welcome back to Games Galore and in today's brand new video we will be talking about how Roblox is super mad at this game for actually copying them. But if you guys are new to the channel make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe and also like the video and share it with a friend. Anyways without further ado let's go ahead and get into this. Roblox is an online game platform and game creation system that allows users to program games and play games created by other users. Now the founder of this is actually Dave Bazuski and Eric Castle in 2004 and it was officially released in 2006. The platform hosts user created games of multiple genres coded in the programming language known as Lua. As of today Roblox is 16 years old and there have been some games actually copying them. Roblox is super furious because these games have actually gained a lot of popularity because some of the YouTubers that have been talking about them and they are not having this one bit. One of these games is actually Brick Hill. Brick Hill is claiming to be the ultimate building block game allowing you to push the limits of digital bricks and make your own games. This is similar to Roblox with the Roblox Studio allowing players to actually create and craft their own games. Now, this game does have its own twist to it but we all believe that Roblox still doesn't accept that. And if you're able to compete build and play with other users in an environment of your choosing with the extreme extensive games made by our users. Basically instead of calling these things like blocks and roblox they are called bricks and the youtuber Kaneko Kitten actually has talked about this game before. The game is very interesting in my opinion but it's way too similar to roblox upon legal standards. Roblox is most likely going to do something to Brick Hill because of how the physics and design of the game are extremely identical to Roblox. Now if you were asked to tell the difference between Brick Hill and Roblox, you will have a hard time trying to tell them apart. Roblox has also been criticized for copying other games as well, and one of the copies of that game was called Imposter and the original game Among Us. Imposter is a Roblox game developed by Arcade Rockstar, and the game is advertised as a heavily inspired Among Us knockoff which is a 2018 Steam game that became exponentially popular in the summer of 2020 because YouTubers started to play it. We don't even know if this game is legal because it basically copies the game Among Us way too heavily. They claim it as something that was inspired but it's clearly a clone of the actual Steam game itself. Besides that, there is another game that Roblox is probably super mad at, and the name of that game is Kogama. Now, Kogama is a free online multiplayer game owned by Multiverse APS. Now, the users spend all their time interacting with other users' creations that may serve as inspiration for their own projects. The creation tools are easy to use and accessible to everyone and built to cater to a growing target audience of gamers who want to also be able to create, modify, and reconstruct their own 3D social experiences and have made their own small disruption to the world of game making. Now this game was criticized to be extremely similar to Roblox with people playing other games people's creations and the YouTuber Kaneko Kitten also actually has made a video on it saying that the game is not an exact copy. People in the Roblox community still disagree though. Roblox is probably mad at this game as well but Roblox is probably way more frustrated towards the game Brick Hill. Looking at all this, we can also see that Roblox is actually a vulnerable target for companies can sue as well. Now when we look at the games like Jailbreak and GTA 5, they are very, very similar. Jailbreak is a role-playing game where inmates escape from a prison and run from the police, and once an inmate escapes, they can explore the city, go for a drive in the desert, rob a bank, or invent a whole new way to play. This is actually very similar to the game Grand Theft Auto V where you rob banks, do heists, play online, and drive around in the desert. The only difference is that Jailbreak has it to where you pick a side from being a prisoner and a police officer, but GTA V RP has that too, which definitely is not a coincidence. But in conclusion, the two games that Roblox is mad at are Brick Hill and Kogama. Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching today's video, we really do appreciate your viewership and don't forget to go ahead, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell as well, comment something nice down below, and we will see all of you in the next video. Thank you for watching, have a great day, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye!